Bang! Neves and Ives. I'm Jared. My lovely wife cares at work, and we have a few unboxings here. So let's get into this one. Oh yeah, this is the Kaiser Mini Sheepdog with it's the non-flipper version. Well, well tuned detent. I really like this one. I don't want to cut too deep into this. Okay, so we got multiple packages here. Okay, yeah. All right, so I am going to put these in a video. I know this is just an unboxing, but Kaiser sent a couple knives that um, these are not exclusives, but they're um, they're only going to make so many of them. And this one is the feist but this is the oh that action's good wow this is the uh, the stormtrooper feist so this is going to be oh man that action this thing is really good like really good front flipping action i've tried the titanium feist i gotta say i'm i think i like this one better Oh, nice inset clip. I don't want to say too much about this because I am going to be doing a video on these two knives because they are both, um, they're only going to be made in a limited run. So if you want to get one, get it now. These are such great little front flippers. Man, this thing's awesome. And it is a Lundquist design. The steel on it is N690, just in case if you did want to get it before my video. Um, I'll just say this right now. Awesome. Awesome. All right, we got another one. Might as well use the little stormtrooper. Nice edge, too. Oh, yeah. The bag letter. Oh, wow. These things are so awesome. So, this is a bag letter in micarta. This is a red micarta, red and black. And this is also N690. These bag letters are awesome. We have a, uh, wow. This one's got, yeah, this is on bearings for sure. That detent is so well tuned. Listen to that detent. Look, just the break, right? Like the, 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 the thumb, today, Junior? thumb studs are perfectly placed. Like I can easily just place my thumb right there and get pressure but the brake it rockets out and then the drop on it extremely smooth listen to that detent man that's awesome i we do have the small one or we did i don't know if we still do i think we do um we've had a lot of kaisers and the kaiser bag letter i never tried the full size one and i don't know why i always wanted one because the small one was so awesome and this is very nice micarta i'm happy with this micarta great great micarta and i don't want to say too much because i am going to put both of these in a video very very cool man that detent is well tuned okay so now this next let me just get into it here. let's use this knife so now we got some more packages oh, 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 oh. don't want to rip the note Okay, so this this last package I opened up because I knew they were all my knives, but there was a gift thrown in there. And this is from EDC Journey. Go and sub to his channel. Awesome, awesome dude. He also gave me some swag and some more maple syrup from Vermont. Vermont's got the best syrup, and I didn't know until he had sent me some. But man, this is a cool slip joint. What is that? I'm not sure the brand. I don't know a lot about slip joints. But, um, oh, look at that. A real spay point. So if you guys ever wonder what a spay point looks like, that is a real spay point. That's why sometimes I call... Um, 
like the Benchmade 940s um, and other blade shapes alike. They're kind of like spay points, but this is a true spay point. It's made for you to use without stabbing something. But obviously, you know, with the 940 and blade shapes like that, you can stab. This, I'm not sure, this feels like a hollow grind. I'm not positive, though. And then this other blade is a, a clip point. Very, very cool. Nice walk and talk. Uh, I'm not sure what material this is. Probably just a synthetic, but I do see some cool copper and uh, brass Come on, focus. Some copper liners. Very, very cool. Awesome. Thank you, bud. I really appreciate that, man. This is awesome. So, there you go. They're in 440C. Now, this next one is some of my own stuff, but there is something else in here that is not mine and i do not know what it is it's sent from stasa for us to review um so we'll see what it is because we sent some um, a knife to stasa and then he sent us some stuff back to check out because he's awesome so this one is oh this one's ours and you oh yeah it's Good to have her back. The Demco AD20. Can't wait for that 20.5. I will definitely probably be getting one of those. I think that, you know, just a thinner grind. There's going to be a lot of things different. I mean, it's there's a lot of things similar about the new one that's coming out, the 20.5, but there's also a lot of differences. What is this? Oh, um the uh the oh uh ah oh, man i can't remember the name of it now i know riat was making these i believe riat was making these it might have been we detents a little late Ooh, ooh, the oh oh man i can't remember the name of it it's driving me nuts oh oh it's right there i knew it was oh something oh oaches works or oak Oak, what, however you pronounce that. Read it yourself. Uh -huh. Oak's design, Ochea's design, something like that. Very good thumb stud action. Detent is a little late on it, though, I noticed. Like, right... Oh, wait, maybe not. Was it just me before? No. It's, like, right there. Oh, it's got a ramp. I think, yep, it's got a ramp, and to get over the ramp, it's big. It's a big ramp. That's what it is. So, you just want to be past it. Past that ramp. Man, it's got a good, strong detent, though. Great ergos, good little, or good uh, finger troll. Not a big one, but a good one. Nice hollow ground blade. Feels pretty slicey. Looks like titanium liners, titanium clip. I've never tried one of these, and I always wanted to. I believe, I'm not positive, but no, they don't say drop or mass drop on it. I thought these were done by mass drop or drop or whatever. Maybe I'm wrong about that part. I thought so, though. Man, you hear that thing? Sounds like you're snapping your fingers or something. That's <laughs> nice action, man. Both flipper tab and thumb stud, but take a good look at it. Beautiful hollow grind. Nice thumb stud. The G10 is nice and grippy. Looks like, uh, man, that's a cool um, um, uh, pivot. It's like sunken in there. Is that the drop logo? I don't know. I'll know more information after I... Uh, Look into it a little bit more. Like I said, I never got a chance to try one of these. I remember watching reviews on them and stuff. But So, let's get to this next one. The Ochea's design or something like that. Okay, there's a couple things in here. Stasa's the man. Definitely go sub to his channel. Stasa23. Oh, wow. It's a Berg's Blades. <gasps> Wow, 
I've always, I've never tried a Berg blade. There's one more after this, guys, but that is awesome. Look at that flipper tab. A Timascus clip that's just blinding me. For some reason, this blue, like, when I look directly at it, it, like, it blinds me. It always has since I was, like, a kid. Um, it's, I've always been attracted to the crayon color from when I was a kid, when I used to like open up a crayon box and that blue, it would come out and like literally make me blink. Like it's crazy. I don't know if it's just me or if it's other people or I don't know, genetics. I don't know. <laughs> nice action. I've never tried a Berg blade, but I've always wanted to. Man, nice heavy detent. Whoo, -hoo, that is some mood. Man, that landing zone. Look at that landing zone. Very, very comfortable landing zone. Nice jimping. The flipping action is amazing. This is a little bit of a thick grind. You can see how thick the blade is, but that's the way these are. I, I always knew that about these. That break is really nice. Nice finger choil. Well, nice sharpening choil. I wouldn't call it a finger choil, but it's close to it. Titanium frame lock, lock bar insert, checkered micarta or carbon fiber. Checkered carbon fiber that's done very well. Yeah, that's cool. And then you can see the pattern on the inside of there. This is awesome. I feel very lucky to get to try one of these clip point blade. Awesome. Oh, can I reverse flick? Oh, no, I can't reverse flick that. But let's get to this next one. Remember, Stasa23 should already have went over there and subbed to him. Oh, man. You know what? I almost ordered one of these, but I didn't. This is... I can't remember the name of it. I know it's a Kaiser. Um, or a, It's either a Concept or a Kaiser because they both have a very similar design. I think this one's a Concept. Yes, it is a concept. It is the concept. I can see the designer. However you pronounce that. Uh, Maxrom design. Wow. That has some really good... Is that a front flipper? Yeah, you can do it. It doesn't have any jimping, so I don't think it's intended for it. But man, is it easy to do. I don't know if it was. I don't think it was intended for it because it, there's no jimping there. But man, it's ooh, that was my fault. It's very easy to do. Look at this jimping on the back spacer. Very cool. All titanium, all blacked out. Really good thumb stud action. It is a... Uh, you know, a type of Tonto, more of a Japanese Tonto because it is rounded up here instead of straight. Um, you do have good lockup. Nice ergos for a small knife because, you know, it's not a neutral grip, but it's, oh, it's practically a neutral grip. They just give you the one spot for this pointer finger, and then you have a really good spot for there. Man, and you could technically just turn this into a drop point or a harpoon blade by getting rid of this little point by just sharpening it like a drop point. Or, you know, you can keep it a tonto. Either way, they're pretty much going to function the same. Man, that thumb set action is so good. You can reverse flick very easily. It's extremely drop shutty. Nice and centered. Um, concepts clips are really good. The tension's really good. I, I already know this is probably a good clip. Man, it's weird that they did not just put the jimping right there, right? Because you could easily front flip it. Um, and then you'd have jimping right here. It's kind of weird that they didn't do that. I don't know why. But very, very cool. I'm happy I get to check this out. S35 VN blade steel. Very, very drop shutty. Where's the detent on it? Nice and early, too. And you do have a little thing right here that hits your finger, so you don't have to worry about the blade hitting you. It's got this little part right there that hits your finger when you unlock it before the blade. Very cool 
Nice finish too. It's nice and it's very smooth, but it's got the jimping in some, you know, some of the good places and it's got, you know, the groove. So you still are locked in, even though it is very slick. Very awesome. Um, thank you, Stasa. And like I said, guys, go sub to his channel. If you're not, I don't know what you're doing with yourself. Um, definitely don't admit it to anybody. Uh, <laughs> I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.